to make a great piano duo, you do need to be able to get along really well. Uh, piano duo is a very, very um, tough ensemble because when we decided we want to play piano duo, we wanted to do it the same as a solo pianist. The piano is this master of, of illusion and we don't really uh, create a continuous sound and the way we make a piano sing and make a beautiful music is by a very, very uh, fine balance and very fine timings. And it's like we get into a microcosmos and nothing else exists. Um, and each work is our own uh, world and each phrase is just like we have a huge breath um, with no time limit, so the clock just stops ticking and we sit with this music and we have to imagine it and we have the perfect condition to realize our dreams. Um, but in a way, it's like we're both dreaming the same dream at the same time. The Liszt Sonata is, is a very, very special case because um, Saint-Saëns and Liszt were really good friends. And I think Saint-Saëns' treatment in this piece is not so much trying to make it bigger, but sort of a, a way to show how he understands the piece and how he understands the phrasing. see that Saint Sans is not always doing what we are sort of take for granted today. It's quite fascinating. And his treatment, technical treatment in, in material is, is just unbelievable. piece which is written for piano or pedal piano organ or violin and orchestra and we play another version for two pianos we actually make a kind of translation of the piece uh, or maybe look at it through different eyes or different angle Our last CD together was uh, the two big ballets by Stravinsky. Uh, it's such a different world to record now romantic repertoire. Um, if in the Stravinsky we've been bold, we've been very transparent, we've almost have been black and white as for how the lines are shaped. Now we, we're looking for the flexibility, for the warmth, for the beauty of sound and for the freedom, basically. Um, it's something that, of course, we have to achieve together. So, especially in this kind of repertoire, um, the way we melt into the sound of each other, the way we shape the phrases, the timing of our breath um, are very, very crucial. And we just feel it's like now it's the right time to, to do something very, very different. Mm -hmm. 